The universe is a crazy place. There are so many unanswered questions. How big is it? What's it doing right now? What's it going to do in the future? I'm Adrian Pickerel, and I'm going to answer a few of these questions for you right now. The universe is assumed to be about 13.8 billion years old, which means the Big Bang happened 13.8 billion years ago. And if you were able to look 13.8 billion light years into the distance, you would theoretically be seeing the edge of the universe. Scientists estimated this by determining the ages of some of the oldest stars in the universe, and by measuring how fast the universe is expanding. Now, why is the universe expanding? The most likely explanation is that it's being pushed apart by something called dark energy and dark matter. See, dark energy and dark matter make up 96% of the universe. The other 4% is everything we know. We have no idea what dark matter and dark energy is, but we're pretty sure they're there. We can tell that the universe is expanding by looking at the light from other stars. Type 1a supernova typically have the same brightness, so by looking in the change in their brightness, we can see how they're moving. Let me show you. This technique is called the Doppler shift. Basically, when something is moving away from us, the light that it gives off will appear more red, or red shifted. This is because when it moves away from us, it pushes its light waves away, which spreads them out. Red light has the largest wavelength of any other color, so when the waves are spread out when they reach us, it looks more red. When an object is moving toward us, it looks more blue shifted because it pushes its light waves towards us, making them reach us faster. By observing these changes, cosmologists were able to determine that the universe is expanding at an accelerating rate. This leads us to our next question. What's going to happen to the universe? Is it going to keep expanding forever? While we can't ever be sure, there are a few theories that scientists have. The first one is called the Big Freeze. This scenario states that as the universe continues to expand, stars will run out of fuel to form, making space very cold and very dark. Black holes will dominate the universe, but even they'll disappear over time. Essentially, the universe will become very empty. Another theory is called the Big Crunch. This theory is basically the opposite of the Big Bang. Just as the universe started out as a single point, it would end in the same way. The universe will continue to expand until the density is enough to stop it and start contraction. Kind of like a rubber band stretching and stretching until one day, it snaps back together. This theory goes hand in hand with another one called the Big Bounce. The Big Bounce is the idea that after the universe collapses into a single point, it leads to another Big Bang and the formation of a new universe. This would form a cyclic repetition of the Big Bang, where every new universe is a result of the collapse of the previous one. So, the fate of the universe is unknown, and it's kind of scary to think about. But hey, it probably won't happen for billions of years, so don't worry about it. Yeah.